So real quickly, let me show you how you can set these uh, SOE, SEO settings on the save links and pages for IDX Broker. Before I do that, I just want to mention real quickly, you want to make sure that your wrappers are set up. There's some basic SEO settings on the details pages and things that always need to be taken care of first. In this case, they, they are taken care of. So let me just click here. We can see the... Uh, search criteria here on the pages and uh, the preferences. We go here to the SEO settings and this is where it's important. Uh, Alcoa, Jupiter Homes for Sale in this case, or Abacoa, I apologize. And uh, then just some information that's here um, about the, this is the medic, tags, descriptions, some things that apply to the site. And then usually I suggest that you include some of the same information in a subheader with that page so that um, Google can see the same type of content there. I won't take time to write that in there, but I, maybe I'll just copy that here so we can see what it looks like. And then, uh, and then I'll go back and edit that. The keywords, most of the browsers, especially Google, or the search engines, especially Google, at this time are not really using meta tag keywords very much. So I wouldn't even worry too much about that. Um, but anyway, so if we put this in here and we hit save changes, then let's go back to saved links. And let's just take a quick look at this uh, at this page. You can see that this is the content that we put in that page. Now you can't leave that there because that's just too spammy having it the exact same content. But we can rewrite that and maybe put a picture in there at the top of the page uh, that will make it look attractive. So real quickly. Something is just crazy with my mouse here. Uh, let's see what we put here. Condominiums.
Okay, of course, you could go on and on and write all kinds of stuff. I'm not much of a writer, but that's something. Um, so we can pop an image in here. You know, I need a uh, URL of the image here, so I don't, I don't really have anything right now that I can add. So I won't put an image in there. Um, I might just change this. This is paragraph text, which is fine. It's a little small, I think, for what we're trying to do. So I'm going to remove this. And uh, if you have a team or an office uh, account, you can actually assign this to a specific agent. And that's kind of a neat tool. So that all the leads that come from that page are assigned to that particular agent. So let's see now what it looks like. Okay, so I don't know, that might be too big or too wordy or whatever it is, but and I can see this font looks a little bit bigger than that one. I'll go back and check that. But that's basically how you, you do that. And uh, if we were to put a, uh, an image in there, let's say we go here and we're going to put this image in. Then maybe what I would do is and again this is just you can do it however you want. And then I'll put Abacoa Homes and Condos to give it a little something different. Let's see what options we have alignment. Uh, I'll put it in the middle. Uh, it's middle a different way. Uh, I don't know what I did. I guess I'll just leave it like it was. And uh, the dimensions, that might be too big. You can put borders and spacing and all these other things here. Um, when people mouse over, there can be a different image. But in this case, we'll just leave it like this. Uh, let's see what this looks like. And then we'll end the video. So it's kind of jammed up in there and it's too close and too big and long and all kinds of problems. But you can see how that's done. Okay.